Okay everybody, well as you can see from the title of the video, I finally found one part that I've wanted for the pot scrubber. It's not the main lower panel, still trying to find that best I can, but what I did find on eBay finally was the Atokic panel. That's basically the most very bottom panel that goes across, well, the bottom. <laughs> and actually, um, even though I got it from eBay, it apparently came from here. And this sounds like a pretty interesting um, company. Maybe I'll uh, look it up when I get the chance. Um, if you want, just go ahead and pause the video and uh, you can read that. Anyway, uh, here's the box. It arrived uh, just shy of a week ago. And here it is. This looks just like the one that I remember from when we had the pot scrubber back when at the Long Island house. Um, it's definitely used, as you can see. There's like a little bit of stainage here and there. It's a little bent in some places, but I'm sure um, those can be worked out. Now, what did, um, hold on, before I get into that, let me go ahead and flip it over. You can see it's definitely, um, the sound insulation is gone, but I'm sure um, if I wanted to put more on there somehow, I'm sure I'd be able to do it. So here's the two vents right here. And yeah, if I look at the, from the workbench, you can see it's a little bit bendy in some places, but again, I'm sure that could be worked out. So one thing I do remember, interesting, interestingly enough, from when we had the pot scrubber back when was, uh, I think the sound insulation was kind of overdone because I remember this vent is where I'd hear the motor from back when. But um, these two vent um, slots right here, they had the sound insulation over them. And looking back, it didn't cause any problems. But I'm like, if these are vent slots here, these probably shouldn't be covered. Because I'm sure, you know, even though the motor for the pot scrubber only gets, like, warm throughout its entire cycle, you know, you want to have as much um, air circulation as possible. So I don't quite know exactly why these were covered like that. But, I mean, that, that's a moot point by now. But um, I just know to keep these open when the time comes. And here's the part number right here. Okay, and yeah, it took multiple searches on eBay. For the longest time, I, I was only finding like the modern Tokik panels for like the um, the ones that have um, you know the drain valve motor setup nowadays more modern. You know, I'm going with that. And I did find one a few months ago, but it was white, and I was like, eh, no go. But then about a week ago, I saw this, and I was like, perfect. So again, I'll just need some cleaning, a little bit of working out to try to get some of the bends out, but. Very happy to have this. As a matter of fact, let's go over to the dishwasher and um, we'll go ahead and take a look. And you can kind of see how it all comes together. Now, the way it works is these two slots here on the side, as you can see, those are for the screw holes. One, yeah, one right there and the other one's right here where I currently have the ground wire attached to. And basically, let me see if I can get this to um, just kind of stand in place. Let's see here. Get an idea of what it would look like. It's way out of adjustment, as you can see. The dishwasher itself is way too, is way too high, but uh, yeah, check that out. So a little bit more of the pot scrubber coming together. Again, I'm still trying to find that lower panel. It's been quite a task. And also, you like you know, some people have left comments saying they're getting rid of a dishwasher similar to this. They had the lower panel, but like I'll leave a reply to comments. I'll I'll um. I'll even give them an email address, they can email me, but it's a bust every single time. That's like three or four times now that it's happened, but not giving up. So if I can find this toe kick panel, I definitely have hope that I can find the, um, I can find the uh, lower panel that goes with this. That'd be a just awesome find. Just gotta keep trying, I guess. Anyway, there you guys go. Just a little short video. Got this finally for the bottom of the dishwasher. Very happy about it. At some point I'll clean it up, strain it out, and it should look good, but uh, so far we're making good, good progress on this pot scrubber. Man, I remember in 2020 just how excited I was that I finally got one, and um, just that in itself was the best. And now that we got this, it's definitely a good start in the right direction. Hopefully soon enough we'll get the lower panel, but for now, very happy to have this. Thank you very much for watching, and take care.